Well, the data that I'm presenting is on the biologic bradalumab. Um, this is an IL-17 receptor blocker. Uh, and it is one of the three uh, biologics in the class that deal with the IL-17 and IL-17 receptor. The data that we're looking at today is looking at response um, by um, investigator assessment and by patient assessment of people who've had psoriasis for different durations. The top line data that I'm going to share is that um, regardless of duration of psoriasis, that patients had a very high response as measured by PASI scores and also had a high response as measured by either a DLQI of zero or one, which equates to high quality of life, and also by the PSI score, which is psoriasis score, um, which had to be less than equal to eight. Well, I, I think that we know that brodalumab is certainly one of the most effective drugs uh, that we have for the treatment of psoriasis. And what I think that this um, helps to uh, double down on and, and emphasize is that no matter how long someone's had their psoriasis, this drug will still be effective for them. And when you look at those different ranges, it doesn't matter whether it's a new onset or a person who's had it for more than 10 years. And, and I think this is very important when we make choices about um, the biologics we use because we know that sometimes people who have had longer disease or have been biologic failures are more difficult to treat. But when we take this group and we put them together and then we find out that the treatment does not vary um, despite um, those differences, I think that is very significant.